What's up guys, MVDB Natural Warrior Tribe, and in this episode, we're going to discuss should you become a billionaire and achieve all the goals you want, get all the money you want in life, or should you join a Buddhist monastery and forget about all the stressors of life and live in harmony, sit all day and do nothing, wander away, whilst you observe the flower of life. Okay, let's look at the first example. Should you become a billionaire and grind your way every single day? Let's get at it and let's get that goal. Eyes on the prize. Well, I mean, I know some people that do that and, and to some certain extent, I believe in hard work. I believe in, in that grind. Um, and, and you know, it's, it's a great way of accomplishing every goal that you want. Um, to some certain extent, you, you gotta put in the work. But I also know people that are burning themselves out because that is um, actually what you're doing while you get at it and you never stop. I once spoke to a, um, an old man like in his 60s um, when I was working at a Spanish farm and I asked him, you know, when uh, when his vacation was, he said, vacation? No, what is that, man? I mean, we got to provide, we got to, you know, bring food on the table. And I mean, I get that, but when are you going to start enjoying life then, right? If you're working all day, 365, 24-7, there's, I mean, what is there to enjoy if you just work, 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 and you, I mean, that guy... He was good at it, it was what he was doing, but ah, there are so many people that are just not enjoying their work and that, ha that believe that have to provide. Fuck that. Okay, so should you instead then join a Buddhist monastery, sit all day, do nothing, and get away from all the stressors of life? I don't think so. Because, let's be honest, and I mean, I love Buddhist monasteries, I love Buddhist monks, and they're super creative people, love people, and the world will be better off if there would be more people um, like uh, Buddhist monks and, um, and, and join Buddhist monasteries, for sure. But should you, should you sit all day and forget about stressors of life? That's not what a, a Buddhist monastery isn't about, neither. Uh, but we're talking extremes here, right? And let's be honest, if you go and sit in a Buddhist monastery and forget about everything and just observe that flower, not much is going to happen in the world. But what if I tell you that you can have both, that you can grind your way, but just stop from time to time, and join that Buddhist monastery in your house. I mean, meditate or, or go to France and, and, and join a, a Buddhist monastery for a week. Yes, you, I mean, that's what it's all about. It's about going to extremes, but always come back to the middle way. You can have both worlds. And if you're one of those people um, sitting on the train and not really loving their jobs, and hoping that they can escape on vacation or in a Buddhist monastery, fuck that. That is not what life is all about. Join those two extremes. Go to two extremes. Explore what you need to have that balance in your life and get at it. Peace.